Hi everyone, here we've got Samsung Galaxy Tab A6 Lite and let me share with you how to change this navigation bar with the buttons into the gestures. So uh, firstly, let's take a look at this navigation bar and I'm quite sure that you know for what they are responsible for, but let's make a little revision. So let me enter the settings and firstly, this button is responsible for getting back to the previous page. So as you can see, we just got back to the general settings just by tapping on this, let's say, where I can you can go to the home page and by tapping on the three bars I can you can enter the recents so after this little revision we can uh, go and focus on it how to change those buttons to the gestures so uh, let's enter the settings and here we have to tap on the display option now let's scroll down in order to find the navigation bar so let's tap on it and as you can see here we've got two different options to choose from we've got buttons and swipe gestures of course the button buttons are right now applied under it we've got the button order so you can change the position of particular uh, buttons so of course it's up to you if you'd like to uh, leave the buttons if not, uh, just tap on swipe gestures. And as you can see right now, it is activated, it is marked. So uh, here we've got, let's say a little preview of how to use the uh, swipe gestures. And under it, we've got some gesture hints, a show button to hide keyboard and block gestures with S pen so of course it's uh, really up to you which option you'd like to leave activated and which one you'd like to turn off so um, I will leave it like this I won't move it actually and uh, all I will do is tap on more options because here I can show you another options which we can choose uh, here we've got this option marked so we will swipe from sides and bottom and I will actually leave this option right uh, after after you know the whole cost um, customization now after the whole explanation and uh, next to it we've got swipe from bottom so as you can see here we will have three different areas which will be responsible for particular um, buttons so uh, here we will be able to swipe uh, actually let me activate that and show you as you can see here we've got three areas and this one is uh, responsible for getting back this one uh, for the home screen and this one to open the recent so actually you know the position of these areas Areas are just the same as it was with the buttons but let me pick this option and as you can see here we've got also the gesture sensitivity so uh, by swiping you can choose the sensitivity you'd like to use it's up to you and here we've got some notes that if you are using a case it might be difficult uh, to do the back gestures uh, at the edge of the screen so choosing a higher sensitivity might help and if you sometimes do the back gesture un unintentionally try a lower sensitivity so actually you will have to try everything and check how uh, how intensive you would like to set the gestures so actually that's all and now let me show you how the gestures work of course as i said here we've got the preview and uh, but i will uh, show you how to actually use it so uh, by swiping very up we can go back to the home page as you can see it's quite easy and uh, now let me enter the settings again for not, for example notifications and in order to get back so in order to get back to the generals we have to swipe from the left to the uh, to the in, to the middle of our screen so this is how we uh, get back and uh, let me show you the recents all you have to do is swipe your finger up gently and hold it somewhere here so this way and as you can see here we've got the recents opened so actually that's all this is how to set the gestures in your samsung galaxy tab s6 Lite. thank you so much for watching i hope that this video was helpful and if it was please hit the subscribe button and leave the thumbs up